Tapi bercerita mengenai nak pergi Aziata Arena, Suhui dengan Erin Chia. Mestilah kita nak bersama dengan rakan setugas di Aziata Arena yang mengikuti rapat separuh akhir Masters Malaysia, Muiz Aziz. Hai Muiz. Hai Fariha. Okey ke tu? Kita nak cari daripada awal tadi baru dapat cari Muiz. Okey, takkan tak okey. Mui sentiasa okey lah. Ya, Alright, Mui. Mungkin boleh share sikit macam mana sebenarnya keadaan di stadium sebab Farah tak sempat lagi pergi. Mungkin kejap lagi nak pergilah kalau sempat. Uh, keadaan di stadium apa yang saya boleh katakan memang exciting lah. Fans ramai walaupun esok hari raya haji. Uh, memang nampaklah mereka amat meminati dengan sukan badminton ni. So, saya terpaksa puji lah kesetiaan badminton lovers kepada pemain-pemain negara kita Farihah dengan Lily. Yes, okey Muiz, uh, tadi kita dah orang kata bukanlah bukanlah rasa kecewa tapi ialah sebab Perli dengan Tina uh, kalah kepada beregu ranking nombor satu negara Farihah. So mungkin Muiz sempat bertanyakan kepada mereka berdua uh, perkembangan mereka selepas perlawanan tadi Muiz. Uh, yes Lily, memang sempat takkan tak sempat. Uh, apa yang saya boleh katakan, mereka akui lah bahawa uh, opponent mereka tu terlalu laju, very agresif tapi tanpa melengahkan masa. Uh, lebih baik kita dengar sendiri apa kata mereka tentang perlawanan tadi. At my ankle, so during that one point, the ankle just stuck to the ground, I couldn't move. So, but yeah, I'll get medical attention soon and we'll see how, yeah. Uh, you all have never met the Chinese fans, so this was your first meeting. Do you think uh, you all were not very, uh, you all don't understand their game well or something like this? Um, I think uh, many players, all the top five, top ten players, their game plays always aggressive. So the main thing that we need to take back is to be more, uh, a bit more faster in our speed and also more aggressive uh, and sustainable in in the game yeah uh, uh, you have shown that uh you not know, by playing few times with uh, you know, the top players like with uh Sayuri Sayuri and uh, uh Fukushima uh, that you guys will eventually able to beat them would you, would you think that uh, by playing them more maybe there's a, I mean in future that you guys can beat them yeah i think Playing with them really uh, gain a lot of experience. Like match by match, we really learn a lot of things. We made some mistakes and then we come back stronger. Yeah, I think playing with them really uh, make us improve match by match. Match by match. Uh, compared to the Japanese and Korean players, maybe do you feel like they are playing slightly more different? Uh, I think yeah, there is some difference in all the other different pairs and this pairs. They are really more aggressive and they keep putting the pressure on us. So yeah, like what Perry said, it's a lesson to learn and then come back stronger the next time. Would you say that the gap is very big? Everyone has a fighting chance. Um, overall, how you all think about your mission masters reaching the semi-finals? Yeah, we are really, of course, we are really happy, but of course not satisfied because I think there are still room for improvement and there are still a lot of things that we need to improve. Uh, please, no last question for me. Maybe you can tell us, uh, after this, what's next? The plan. Uh, so, after this Malaysian Masters, we will uh, have one day break and then we'll get back to training for the Commonwealth Games. Yeah, that's so that's our next target. No, we'll be focusing on our Commonwealth Games. Yes. Sorry? After this, you must have to Commonwealth Games. Commonwealth Games, yes. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's okay lah. Tapi kita kata comeback stronger lah untuk seterusnya fokus next betul. game kan. Walaupun Tapi Muiz, break, betul. Kan? Nak tanya juga dengan kecederaan Tina tadi, macam mana keadaan sekarang? Mungkin akan berehat dulu ke ataupun akan terus ke Singapura, ter, terbuka Singapura pula lepas ni? Uh, Okey Fariha, seperti yang dinyatakan uh, Tina dengan Perli tadi, mereka tidak akan sertai uh, Singapore Open dan juga uh, Taiwan Open uh, dan mereka akan terus uh, rehat sehari dan uh, sambung berlatih pada hari Isnin untuk Commonwealth Games. Bagaimanapun, Tina pun telah bergerak ke medical room sebentar tadi untuk lihat uh, kecederaan, tahap kecederaan ankle dia. Uh, tetapi uh, daripada mulut Tina sendiri dia menyatakan ia bukan kecederaan besar cuma sakit sedikit je jadi kita harapkan yang baik-baiklah untuk Tina. 
Alright, okay kita move on lah eh, mm -hmm. daripada perlawanan Tina dan Perli. Okay, Muiz, uh, ketika ini Aaron Shah dan Sohik sedang uh, beraksi bersama dengan Fajar dan pasangan je. Mungkin semalam Fajar dan pasangannya telah pun menewaskan Pata Timo Boys. Mm -hmm. um, prediction Muiz sendiri dan boleh tak bagi perkembangan terkini kalau Muiz sempat jengok tadi before cross dengan kita orang kan? Uh, apa yang saya boleh kongsikan perkembangan terkini adalah bahawa Aaron dan uh, Sowi telah tewas set pertama malangnya tetapi setakat ini mereka berjaya kembali bangkit dan mendahului perlawanan last saya tengok adalah 11-5 dan uh, sebenarnya jangkaan saya untuk perlawanan ini adalah sebenarnya Aaron Cha dan Sowi mampu mengalahkan gandingan Indonesia ini ini kerana kalau kita lihat sebelum ini Aaron Cha dan Sowi pernah mengalahkan gandingan Indonesia ini pada 2019 dalam tiga kejohanan berturut-turut jadi sebenarnya mereka berpotensi untuk memenangi pelawan ini cuma ia bergantung kepada tahap kesediaan uh, kekuatan mental diorang Fariha dan Billy. Alright, okay. Harapnya kemenangan berpihak kepada Erin Char dan Sohi dalam set kedua ini. And Muiz, uh, jaga diri kat sana. Kalau sempat kita sampai teman Muiz. Eh? Mm, nanti update yang best-best lagi, okay? Alright. Bye, bye Muiz. Bye, Thank you. Okay, alright. Bye-bye. <laughs>